Yo, what up everyone? VT Green 802 here, back with another beer review. And tonight, got another awesome stout ahead of us. This one's coming to me uh, locally, actually. This is uh, Rock Art Brewery out of Morrisville, Vermont. And uh, this is their bourbon barrel aged Russian Imperial Stout. Now, it does not tell what barrels they are aged in, but I did call the brewery, and um, what I was told was they are barrel aged in Jack Daniels barrels. Not sure exactly which one, per se, or if it is the Jack Daniels, because if it is the Jack Daniels, the normal one, that's, from what I understand, a Tennessee whiskey, but enough of that, and let's go ahead and get into this beer. Oh, I bet this is going to be good. Let's try this. Ooh. Definitely getting oak. It's not pitch black coming out of the uh, bottle here. This is 10% uh, alcohol by volume. This one here. Go ahead and put a top on that for the time being. <clears throat> Keep it nice and fresh. Let's go ahead and get a nose on it. Ooh, wow. That is in your face. Definitely getting bourbon. Definitely smells like bourbon. Lots and lots and lots of oak. Tons of that charred oak. Well, that smells awesome. A little bit of licorice in there too. That strawberry Twizzler lic lic licorice though, that's what I'm getting out of it. All right, let's go ahead and try it. Cheers guys. <laughs> Holy fuck. <clears throat> All right. There is tons. I'm getting a lot of chocolate. That is smooth toffee. Definitely getting that bourbon. Mmm. And there is some booziness on the back of this, definitely. But it is fucking good. Oh, wow. <clears throat> now I did chill this. <clears throat> so it is nice and cold. Wow. It's a little bit thin on the mouthfeel definitely not super chewy or heavy or anything like that for you know a 10 percent imperial stout but the flavor and aroma on this is out of sight absolutely awesome definite chocolate not so much coffee in there really as there is bourbon that oak and that chocolate. Wow, that is a phenomenal beer. <clears throat> so, Jack Daniels barrels. Huh. 70 IBUs on this one. I do not have a bottle date on this. That is awesome. Yeah. 
The alcohol really does stick with you on this one. That aftertaste is bourbon. That is crazy. Definitely a first time use barrel that they used. That's all you get on this. Is that bourbon and chocolate and oak. That is fucking. This is really good, guys. <clears throat> this was $14 a bottle. Not super bad for price. Not great either, but worth it, yes. Yeah, this is definitely good. You can see how much is left in the glass already. <clears throat> it honestly tastes more than 10% alcohol. It tastes like 14%. <laughs> wow. What an awesome stat, you guys. Once again, out of Morrisville, Vermont, we got Rock Art Brewery here. The Russian Imperial Barrel Aged Stout. I'm going to go ahead and give this one a uh, solid 98. Yeah, I'm going to give this one a 98. Absolutely awesome beer. No complaints on it. Um, once again, everybody, VT Green 802 here. Thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And thank you guys for all the views on my last uh, video that I put up, which was uh, Founder CBS. I think it's at 830 views right now, I do believe. So thanks, everybody, for checking that out. And uh, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.